What is up everybody, welcome back to race 3 of our NASCAR Thunder 2004 career mode. Our rookie season. Um, first race Daytona we finished like 17th. Next race, I believe we finished uh, 32nd in that race. We, we qualified 8th, but uh, didn't have a very good race. Um, got turned, so we finished 32nd. We recovered back, so um, we're 23rd in the standings right now. And I believe we are 2nd in the... Uh, Rookie of the Year standings right now. Yep. So, um, what I decided to do is for our garage, we went ahead, we're gonna go ahead and repair all these. Um, our Daytona chassis engine and, uh, our body. So we're gonna head and repair those. Um, we, did, we didn't reach the amount of money that we needed in order to get the expedited one, the three-day one, for our engine hoist, or engine shop, I mean. So we're just gonna go ahead and do the 500,000 6th race purchase, so we're going to go ahead and do that, get that going for us. So afterwards in 6th races, we'll have plus 10 engine power, and we'll increase our storage by 2, so we can build more engines, and they'll be more powerful. So um, We'll probably just go down the line, well I can't show you now, but on each one, I want it to be even all the way down, like even chassis, even engine, even, even body, so we don't have like an overpowered engine, and then our... You know, there's no point in doing that if your chassis is crap and it can't grip enough to even put that power to use. So, um, that's kind of my mindset as far as that goes. But we're going to go ahead and head to uh, Las Vegas. We're going to be using the same car that we had when we uh, went to Rockingham. And the car was good. But, uh, you know, I just made a bad mistake on my part. I believe the car got tight coming off of two and um, got spun a little bit. It could have been a lot worse, though, so... We'll see how our car is here. Again, it's been forever since I've raced here, so um, we'll just see. We'll see how qualifying goes. And if we can just get a nice top 35, top 30, I'd be stoked with that. I'm just not sure how hard we can push because this is a more of a uh, horsepower track than Rockingham was. So um, we'll just jump into qualifying and see how the sucker does. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there's not a lot of banking there. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. Wow. That caught me off guard. Okay, that corner's a lot better. Man, I just was not expecting that. Yeah, that's gonna be a dead last right there. We need to qualify a little bit better for, our, I believe, our secondary sponsor. So that corner was decent. Get a little bit loose in there, but. Okay. Hope we can get a good run off right here. All right, so we qualified last. The car was absolutely horrible. I'm not sure how well we can do to even fix it, really. Let's bring that down a little bit. Um, we'll see how it does in race trim. NASCAR Winston Cup Racing has hit the jackpot this week as we come to Las Vegas Motor Speedway for today's UAW Daimler Chrysler 400. What are your thoughts on this race? The drivers need to get a good feel for this track early on. With all the green flag laps they run here, if you make a mistake early on or miss an adjustment in your first stop, your race will quickly become worse and worse. Ryan Newman won 2002 Rookie of the Year honors after an impressive sixth place finish in the points. That was a great rookie battle that came down to the last race of the season. This guy should have a long and successful NASCAR Winston Cup career to look forward to. that we skipped the intro on the last race. Oh, 
can't believe we qualified dead last. Let's hope we're a little bit faster here on the race. Still just overdriving these corners, and that's just my bad. I'm forgetting how flat this track is. I think we're definitely going to get on the wedge, though, whenever we come in. I know we're running 37th, but I really feel like we have a top 30 car, though. Not because I'm passing these guys easily, but just... It's weird, I can like feel the potential that it has, if that makes sense. So whenever we come in, this is probably going to be a one-stop race, is what it's looking like so far. Um, I'll bring the wedge down. We'll see how these tires wear, depending on the... Oh, man. Uh, yeah, the wedge needs to come down. Like half a round, if not a full round. That was really the first time it's gotten tight coming off, though. Oof. Wow, that was just horrible. I'm just excited about whenever we get like better cars and stuff, we can actually start doing something with this. Right now it's just... Oh my god, we're already 11 seconds back. Wow. Okay, maybe we do got like a 35th place car. Right now it's just so tight I can't even get in the gas coming off like I want to. See, I remember that glitch. They say he's a 22, but he's actually the 26. Driving the 22 in this game. Number 22 oh my still God. Ahead. We're falling back. Focus on your marks, buddy. Clear all around. Man, I was trying to right break early so I can get a good run off, but it doesn't really work here that well. So we're almost halfway on our fuel. I don't know if I already set. Yep, there we go. <clears throat> God, I'm just drifting around these tracks now. At least, I mean, we're 37th solidly. Those guys behind us are way back there. And we're hanging with the people in front, so. I think whenever we come in and adjust a little bit, we can get that little bit we need to finish in the top 35. Easy, buddy. That left front tire's seen some action. 
just needs to hurry up. This is crazy. I kind of just drive this track like Phoenix, just going down the apron like that. It's really starting to fade on me now. I know it seems like it busts like loose going in, but it's like a manageable <laughs> loose if that makes sense. I mean, I can deal with that, but I can't deal with it just tightening up coming off because you can't do anything then. Okay, we'll probably come and pit next lap. Pit road's getting busy. Leaders are headed in. Got one down low. Coming up on cars exiting pit road. Clear. Kind of tempted to wait for a caution, but... Actually, let's wait one more. I was hoping a caution to come out, but we'll have fresher tires coming out, so it might be able to help us a little bit. Yeah, we're definitely going to come in this time. God, I was hoping we'd be a little bit better here. I think Atlanta's next race, and I'm dreading that. That's all horsepower track, man. Speed, don't speed. Okay. Yeah, go down on that. We'll go up a little bit on that. Um, yeah. Man. I hope this helps a little bit. It feels like just a little bit looser. I know what GG effects going into the corner quarter entry, so it's probably just going to bust out on me and I'm going to wreck it, but. Hopefully it helps coming off the corner a little bit because it's just so tight. I can't get back in the throttle at all. Yeah, we're probably going to be like in the 40s coming out. Yep, dead last. Oh. Don't want to be that guy, but we're going to be that guy. Ah. <sighs> At least we're not a lap down. God, I can't believe that dead last. Hopefully some of these guys we pass are going to be... The car feels a lot better though. This is awesome. I should have took like a five minute practice session after qualifying and just seeing what it was like. Oh, okay. Stuart was the leader, so we were all lap down. Oh, man, this sucks. No, I don't want to do that. <clears throat> mm. We might be able to catch a couple of these guys now, but.
They were catching these two ahead of us pretty quick. You can see how fast Newman and Junior are closing in on us. Good run through three and four. My God, I just don't want to finish last. This this race has been horrible. Oh crap! Oh no! Yeah. Shit! Oh my God, that sucks. Out of frustration, I accidentally turned off my controller somehow. Oh my god. We might as well come in and pit. We were dead last. I think he left like two or three guys. So we can probably pick up a couple positions. God, I'm going to be so happy when we get more power and everything gets upgraded. We're just going to cling to those super speedways and... Oh my god. I mean, as long as we don't DNF out of any tracks, I'd be happy with that. God, my controller's starting to mess up on me. This thing, this is like a day one PS2 controller. You have to like wiggle the cords just right for it to work. But anyway, I mean, as long as we don't DNF or anything like that happen, I'm, I'm happy. I'm expecting this to happen first season. Man, how many people are lapped down? Please be like three. I'm sure they didn't get that far. Oh, cool. Okay. So there's at least five of us. Oh, God. Didn't even do that. Damn. Damn, I got fresh tires, so I can probably get by these guys pretty quick. They're a lot slower. Give that a caution. I just wasn't able to hang on to it. I just drove into it. They're so deep. Trying to catch those guys. And, you know, it's completely my bad. Not sure if any of these guys are left down, but... Right up there up top. In front of this guy. So he's driving in there easy. Yep, that is him. Man, we were able to drive this circle. Oh my god. Well, we have new tires and everything, but. Oh. Wow. And we did just use this body, this whole car at Rockingham, so. It is the used one. Lead changes were... Man. I just need a minute. <laughs> we didn't earn anything off that, hardly. Damn, I was hoping for a lot better. But, that's part of the rookie season. I mean, you're going to get that. Man, so we'll check the standings really quick. I know that's going to hurt us big time on that. I'm sure McMurray finished top 10 probably. So we're going to check it out really quick and uh, see where this puts us at. We can't do anything shop edition wise or building wise. So uh, we just kind of ride it out. We got to use this same car to Atlanta also. Oh my God, it's going to be horrible. So um, Junior just won. It's his first one of the season. So Jarrett's leading, wow, Jarrett's ahead, and we drop down to, oh, 32nd, man, we gotta start finishing better, 
We got to. Um, Jeremy McMurray, rookie of the race again. Wow. So he's starting to pull away. He's at a 150 point lead on us in the rookie of the year. Um, Jeff Gordon just joined them. Ford's still ahead now. And Mark Martin is still the leader as far as laps led. So um, that's what we're going to do for this episode, guys. Next race, we're going to be doing um, Atlanta. And that's going to be something else. So um, I hope you guys stay tuned for that. And I will see you on the next one.